Well, a very good evening to you wherever you are. I do hope that you can join me in appreciating this truly beautiful evening, a night that is absolutely ideal for a game of football. The scenes here really are something, a beautiful picture under the floodlights, traffic and transport round here, not the kindest, but regardless of that, the fans have found a way of getting here. There is a sense of theatre and the decibel levels are rising. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing out loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Catalan capital, home to one of the most formidable teams in history, Barcelona. Well, this is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, the atmosphere, Peter, certainly doesn't feel like a friendly. We all know about the quality we have on show here, so I hope that the crowd demand as much as they can get, and I hope the players will have liked. Great lead! Decent attempt, but not quite good enough. Inter were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Jao Cancelo. Jao Cancelo plays on a charge down the left. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah. Henrik Mkhitaryan. He's not the biggest, strongest or quickest, Peter, but what he lacks in physique, he certainly makes up for with a supreme footballing intelligence and, and great technique. He just seems to be able to see situations develop before anybody else, and he usually tends to pick the right option too. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. De Jong. Ferran Torres. Chalanolu did well to step in there, that was more than necessary. Bastoni. I wonder what you've seen, Jim, over the early moments of the game. Well, neither side has really grabbed the initiative, I would say. Both must have come... And he has been fouled there. Arela. Gunduan. Played out to the left flank. And it's Cancelo. Well, that looks a decent ball. Oh, that's neat. Here's the cross. Cleared away. Plays it forward. Mkhitaryan, Martinez, Dumfries, Barcelona are still to register a shot on target, as a matter of fact, a shot of any type. Barella, he's a sharp little ball here. De Jong, Lewandowski might just make this. He was under real pressure there. He played through for the white man. He's left his man. So much time and space here. Into the box. And that has been cleared. And it's Cancelo. And that has left him in a heap. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Well, they're labouring their way towards the opposition goal here, Peter, and this needs a much livelier solution. Bastoni, Di Marco. Look, they're prepared to be quite physical to contain any danger that might come their way. Goes for the header! Oh, super header, wonderfully acrobatic. He had a decision to make and he got it bang on. You can't beat a diving header. Gol del Inter de Milan. Marcó en el minuto 32 el dorsal 22.
into Milan, draw first blood here. Well, I guess this ought to make things interesting, Peter. No doubt the opposition will now be forced to play a, a more open and riskier game. Turan, and the counter is on. Now it's Martinez. Oh, good spread. He's got plenty of space out wide here. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Martinez. Now Kundawan. Martinez. Spread out to the left. And that's aimed into them. Up to meet it! He has done it! And again, they simply do not know what has hit them. No space, no problem. You just cannot stop him. Yeah, he won the jostle, and it was a very good finish. And I think he'll go away feeling pretty good about that one. So that's two now without reply. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Bastoni. And it's Mkhitaryan. Turns back here, probably the best option. Barella. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. He's got away, and Inter now could counter-attack. Habrá dos minutos de descuento. Turan. Well, that is one way to stop him. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, he knew what he was taking on there, Peter, and special delivery from the ref. He's been doing... And we've reached half-time. How's the first half compared with your expectation? Yeah, chins have dropped, heads are down, and half-time couldn't have come at a better time. That's the start of another 45 minutes. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done, but that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. Rafinha battling down that right flank. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Dumfries, who has made his impact already. Shalhanolu. Dimarco, who set up one goal so far. Dimarco in acres of space out wide. Hello! Oh, the kick has done ever so well. Durant is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Chalanolu plays it short. Hit into the middle. Climbs up big! He would have been quick to recover this. Barcelona can counter promptly here. Martinez, shot, shot at goal! They are rampant! And surely that settles it! And how about the timing of the pass and run? They've worked it before and no doubt they'll work it again. A case now of complete control.
Kunde. There's no doubt it's a long way back, but they can at least give us something to believe the gap might be closed. Petri. Mukatari. Pressure already building up here. It's a Serbi. Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, moving yeah, terrific. I think that sort of play on the side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Not the most accurate pass. Well, the run has been sold a little bit short there. Inter clearly should have gone for the easier pass. Now they'll have to quickly regroup. Gundogan. Rafinha. Nice bit of skill, and he's away. De Jong. There's a real tenacity about their defensive play, and it's up close and personal. Turam, a real chance to break. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And it's played forward. Arnautovic, oh, that's been cut out, well played. Araujo. And it's Kunduan. That's Kunduan. De Jong. Almost 75 minutes on the clock now. Now Kunduan. Araujo. And that's not going to reach. Damian. Dumfries. Oh, that pass isn't the best. Martinez. Loose pass, and they could be in. It's run loose here. He's found a way through. Oh, it's opened up for him. Look at this, and Martinez! Rafinha. Little doubt, that is a foul. And he is going into that little black book. Barcelona can now introduce the first of their substitutes. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Bastoni. Barcelona can admit to being second best so far. They've not looked together enough. Concentration levels are well down on the standard we expect. Let's book at Dumfries. Massive leap! And he hits the net! Cut 
comfort, yet more comfort, easing away. What a great header, got plenty on that. Yeah, he makes those runs with, with great stealth and a ghost-like arrival to get his head to the ball. Things looking so easy, almost too easy here. Joao Felix. And here's Lewandowski. Joao Felix. This is De Jong. And it's Cancelo. Habrá tres minutos de descuento. Los oficios. Oh, here's a chance! Oh, he really got hold of that. Barella. He's gone for goal! And that has flown over. Se va a llevar a cabo un cambio de jugadores. A couple of changes then in quick succession. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make... And that is it, the referee has seen enough. Barcelona thoroughly outclassed here. They came up against opponents who were better in all...